Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix application hang detected error in Fortnite. Let's begin. So what you need to do first is you need to open up your settings and then you're going to go to the Windows updates on the left side of the screen. Afterwards, you're going to select check for updates. Now, after checking for updates, if there are any available drivers to download, then you should download them and then install them on your computer, then restart your system. The second option would be to run the run dialog and then you are going to type in temp and then you're going to hit enter or select OK. After selecting OK, you are going to select every single file here. So if you want a quick way, you go to the top here, then select the three horizontal dots and then you're going to select select all. Afterwards, you're going to right click and then select delete. Now, these are just temporary files which are open and which have been used by certain applications in the past or in the present, and it will not affect your computer in any way. All you have to do is delete every single one of them and then restart your computer and then see if the Fortnite application works. Afterwards, you're going to go to the left side of the screen and you're going to select gaming. Then you're going to go to game mode and then make sure that game mode is on as it's going to optimize your PC to play games while turning things off in the background. And then you're going to select graphics. You are going to look for the Fortnite application. So you are going to go here where these two buttons are, where it says add desktop app, then add Microsoft store app. So you are going to select add desktop app. I'm going to use this one. For example, you are going to select add. And then once you've added Fortnite, you're going to go to the right side here, then select the downward arrow. Now where it says GPU preference, you're going to go to the right, then select the downward arrow again, and then you're going to select high performance and make sure that this is on optimizations for windowed games. And then you go into restart your computer and then see if Fortnite works. And there you go. I hope this video was helpful for you and I'll see you in the next one.